and we're live. Let's see if we can use this old one. All right, I'm gonna open up this. What's up, what's up, everyone? I'm going to attempt, <laughs> I'm going to make smoke one way or another. And with alcohol ink, it just kind of does it for you. So uh, let me go get my phone. I'll be right back. What's up, everybody? What we got here? <laughs> Hi from Australia. What's up, Carolyn? How are you? Vamp. What's up? Um, uh, we got to go through all the emails to check to see. So if you guys weren't here yesterday, um, yesterday we did the rainbow pour. And if you could see, where is that? This little guy right here. Um, I was putting it up on the screen one time, two times, three times. Um, and people never even said anything. I would put it up, take it away, put them up, take them away. Um, she just said there's still no winner. Um, and so the second the video starts, count how many times that popped up. And you have to count each one of them. Not, not if there's three and they all pop up and go away, that's three. You have to count three. So uh, we still haven't got a winner. Um, Queen Love, what's up? Thank you for joining. Hi there, for first time from New York. Love you and your girlfriend's work. Thank you, been watching for a while and I always missed your lives. Well, thanks Queen, welcome to the fam. <clears throat> what was our dates for September? What was the date for September for Florida? So I have to find this. All right, so one of our um, ATD fam, I believe ATD fam, Christy Miranda Art, um, she tagged me in this Instagram video. It looks like it might be from Russia. Let's see. Um, Let's see here. I'm going to try to go here to find the person that did it. Uh, 365 Colorful. It looks like they're from Russia. Um, let's see if you guys can... Well, I'll show this here in a minute. Um, it looks like there's enough people in here. So we're going to try some uh, white smoke with alcohol ink today on a black background. Bada bing, bada boom.
All right, so this is the video, and it looks pretty cool. Like I said, it's, uh, what is it from? 360 color, colorful. I think I'm just gonna use white, and maybe like, maybe I might add a little color to it, I don't know. But it just looked fun, and it really looks like art if you, if you put it down enough, put enough, uh, what do you call it? Alcohol down. So I'm gonna try some white smoke. Uh, thank you, Christy, for tagging me in that. Hopefully if she's on here. Hold on a second. We are live now. Just thank you for the tag. All right. Let's see here. So I have a, uh, there's Bowie. What's up, Bo? You wanna come say hi? Come here. Well, come here. Come here. He, it's playtime all day with this boy. Anytime, it's playtime. He sure brightens it up in here when, when it's like cloudy or rainy. All right, so we're gonna use some panina, penta panina. <laughs> Pinata, how do you say that? How do you say this? Panita, no, pen from Jacquard. <laughs> God, it's so funny. He, you don't hear him and then all of a sudden you hear him run like he's running for his life. Like you know he just did something and he's not supposed to do it, so he just leaves the area immediately. All right. So, I am new at this. So, um, I just painted this black with flat black. So I think I'm just gonna, where's my alcohol? Here we go. Let's fill this up just in case we need some mo. I'm using 91% uh, alcohol. Got on, what do you call it there? Pinata. Okay. What's up, Clara? JJ, what's happening? JJ, did you know, well, you probably didn't know, but um, Vamp apparently has a brick on the sidewalk or on the building or something at the Dallas Cowboy Stadium because she donated to it, to the new building. All right. Thought that was kind of a fun little fact we could share. All right, I need to put this away for something. Oh, and I want to do some fire too. I want to. I want to put. Uh, I want to put the coaster. I want to spray paint a coaster black and see if we can set that on fire. I wonder if the black paint will set on fire though. Maybe if it's dry, I think it would be good. All right, so I should put, should I put alcohol down first? I've never used white. Do we have to steer it? Steer it? We'll shake it up. What's up, Jen? Why 
why it is heavier than the other colors. Um, Glowfish, is that is that bad or I guess we'll find out. <laughs> All right, let's move this. Um, let me. I'm gonna make this so you guys can see the whole thing. Let me adjust this page real quick. I think that'll be good there. All right, you can see pretty much all of it there. Um, who was it, uh, Teresa? Did you get your overhead lamp or your overhead uh, camera holder? If she's in here, I don't know if she's in here. Love the laugh. Thanks, Queen. <laughs> I get that a lot for some reason. I'm humbled. Thank you. I have a couple different kind of laughs. You'll come to uh, you'll come to see that. All right. And you know what I forgot to do the other night, you guys? And you didn't even remind me. Um, I'm going to put a different backing on this. But uh, remember... Ooh, you don't want to leave that on there. Because it leaves stickiness on there. Great. Um, I sanded one of our coasters. And I'm going to put some uh, art coat over it to see if it clears it up. So... Uh, because if you didn't see that video before, if you work at it, like if you really dig up, dig on one of our coasters, uh, the resin will peel off. But that's if you're like getting in there and, you know, uh, trying to make it come off. We, we don't recommend you do that, obviously, if you're using coasters. Um, but if you lightly sand it with 400, the uh, resin should just clear that right up. So we'll get that out of the way. All right, so everybody can see, looks like. Oh yeah, and, and I bet, Miranda, that'll make an amazing uh, solar system. You know what I'm saying? Like put the white down, do some like sprinkles. And then uh, put some uh, color down. God, you could airbrush that. I would airbrush tonight, you guys, but I have to go body paint. All my stuff is packed up, and I don't want to unpack it and then repack it, and then take it to the venue and then unpack it, and then have to repack it. And then help. So we're just going to try to do some a single thing of smoke. Okie dokie. Let's, let's get on with this. Babe, everybody's in here worried about you. She just got out of the shower. Or she's getting all prettified. Alright, let's see. And I'm going to record tonight, I think. Um, so you guys can see what I do when I go out and do these bars. My friend Phil Shambaum uh, has a place called Whippersnapper. You guys should come and check it out if you're ever in here. All right, let's see here. I'm gonna try to make it in the line as possible. This makes it really easy. This little thing here. You know what I should have done is just did it, just... I know what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna take a stick and just dip it in there. Ew. I know I'm going to get hit, but that's what she says. Alright, we'll take one of our small sticks. Where's my heat gun at? <laughs> what happened? Babe, it just turned into powder.
Babe, it's just, it's just like powder. Do you see that? <laughs> Tierra, well, welcome. Thank you very much. That white said nope. White is the worst. But I wonder what kind they used on that video. I guess I could look it up. We were just looking at it. Let's see here. You hear Bowie in the background. Of course, it's all in Russian. It doesn't say and it doesn't like the bottle doesn't have anything on it well how does that work let's go find I'm gonna go find a different white where would oh. different. No, it's the same. I wonder why I did that. And this alcohol is not like... Yeah, that is... It just does not want to work. What, Clara? What, 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 what? What do you, what's up? Jen's comment about mixing a little with blending. I just grabbed some of this. Let's try that. I got a little cup here. Put some in here. Put some blending solution. Mix a little bit in here. <sighs> Look at that, y'all. It's fun. You're not on um, this white. Oh, you did find that one. Well, it's the same as that. Sorry, but if one of them's just old. I'm gonna put this on a little bit lower. Sorry I wasn't listening to you guys. <laughs> yeah, I got it on low. I, I think I'm getting it.
Yeah, you gotta mix it with that stuff. See, this is what I want it to look like. I want it to be like solid on one side. Now I'm, I'm excited to try it with the poster. Look at that, y'all. That looks fun. Let's try to, uh... Alright, let's try... Let me get some more in there. Alright, since that side is pretty much ruined... Let's try to just wipe this off. It does come off. Kinda. And I just spray painted this too. Oh wow. Well. I'm surprised that uh, this spray paint holds up against that. Let's try this again, y'all. So I'm just gonna put a little bit down this time. Thanks, Clara. So a place, um, multi-ones, oneness, just crumbing through comments. <laughs> All right. I don't know if that's going to come off. I'm going to have to repaint this black. Yeah. I'm just going to, we'll just mess around. We'll see. All right. So I mix some. Alcohol blending solution in here. And now we'll just put a little bit down. A little line and a line like this. And then we'll just drop some in here. Let's do a little bit of blending solution in here. Still a little powdery it looks, but it looks awesome when it does dry. Oh, you guys really can't see that, huh? Yeah, that's really weird, like the powder. Like it looks like powder. Oh, just use white with solution. So, all right, well, let's just try this. put down solution and put 
put some white down. Then you see the solution edges. I bet that would clear up if you put. Um, it is low heat. It is low. Um, <laughs> yeah, low fish. So that's fun. What if I just put a little bit of alcohol around it and then that way maybe it'll, it'll like uh, fade it maybe? That's crazy, you guys. It doesn't do anything. Oh, yeah, it does. But lightly, like it almost takes it away. Huh. So, let's move this. Let's make a longer one with the, uh, I'm going to move all this stuff. What about this? You think Liquitex ink would work? Let's try it. Mix in a bottle or cup, white, and then solution, please. And add it to the board. Okay. Let me see what this does. Okay, ink. It turns it into powder. Are you guys seeing this? This looks like wings. That's ink. That's Liquitex ink with just alcohol in it. That's kind of crazy looking. That's fun. How about we try? Well, let's. We're gonna try some. Uh, I'm going to try this Liquitex white ink with uh, a little bit of alcohol blending solution.
I'm not gonna put any alcohol in that. We'll see how this does. Wow, it just makes it really thin. What? I should put my alcohol away. I'm gonna, I'm gonna add a little alcohol just to this top part here. And it does, it dilutes it. But it doesn't act like, uh, like this. That's so weird, it makes it like a, I just added the alcohol. I added the alcohol and it turns it into like gritty, almost like a powder. But it's a pretty cool effect. It almost looks like a rainbow, not a rainbow, an X-ray. X-ray. <laughs> Nice English, Jeffery. All right, so I'm gonna try something. I'm gonna try, I'm gonna mix it. I'm gonna mix the, uh, I'm not gonna use this, this, but this is kind of fun. That was fun, it was a little different. So I have, I have the white pinata, pinata, is that how you say it? With blending solution in it. And then I'm going to put some alcohol down. And then I'm going to add this to the alcohol. Kim Adams, I was absent. Look at it, just turning into snow. That is crazy looking. Well, look at that. Let me just wipe that right off there. Alright, so, how about I could just add it? Don't add it. Let's just use, I'm just going to use straight that stuff. These would make some great waves. How fun is that? That was fun. Jeff, you cleaned the entire board off with... So you can start fresh.
Thanks, KMA. I'm gonna call you KMA. <laughs> <clears throat> Yeah, it kind of looks like lightning, but it's fun. You know what I want to do? I want to see what a color will look over this. So I'm gonna take um, some of this, what is this, Sig? Pure color ink. This is stuff that Jen got us. It's white. I'm gonna put a little bit of this I'm going to put a little bit of blending solution in there and then some of this. I'm going to dump it on here. <gasps> oh, murder. You guys. Obviously, it's going to reactivate it, but it's turning a color. I just added some alcohol to it. That's fun. I thought it would just color it, but why would it? It would just reactivate it. But it's fun. Let's just try. Look how fun. Thanks, Multi. I'm just experimenting. It'll be kind of a short video today. Um, I've got a little body paint. How fun is that? Oh my gosh, if you just kind of blow it, it kind of dries on its own as well. Wow. How fun. So I just literally just put, I just put it directly on there. going to add a little bit of the solution kind of give it a little oomph that y'all how fun is that that looks like rainbow fire y'all
So basically, I put that white down with just the solution. Then I just um, added this just directly, these colors, directly to it and then added a little bit of solution and it kind of just blends all in. Like how fun is that? It's shiny. I would love to know what it would do if you put like a matte spray over it. Is it wet? Yeah, it's kind of sticky. Yeah, I don't like this shine though. But it's fun. So then what you could do, um, how fun. I really like this color with the white. Let's wipe this off if we can. I don't know if we'll be able to because that other stuff was ink. No, I just have to paint this. Working. All right, let's make a little nebula here. What time is it? Eight. If you've joined us, I've, I'm literally just trying to make smoke. <laughs> again and I've made some kind of fire smoke now so I am going to try and do some fire I think I don't know how well this is gonna turn out this looks red and it's red all right so what we do? We we have, we just did we just use this. And I'm going to put some white down. And I'm just going to blow it around. <clears throat> Sorry if all the moving around. I just want to make sure you guys get to see this. Fine, y'all. Like, it's so subtle. I'm glad y'all were here to see this. I 
Alright, let's put a little heat on it. I think we have smoke! So what I'm going to do here, I'm going to put this on the outer. Just do a little at a time, don't get too crazy. It's crazy when it hits that white, it turns into uh, that crazy orange color. Take this camera away so you guys can see that. Well, how fun is that? Thanks, y'all. How fun is that? Y'all, we got a new little something something going on. And now what I'm going to do, I'm going to let this dry. I'm going to heat this up. And I'm going to add just a teeny bit of white to the tips of this white up here, or to this yellow. And then what that's going to do is make it look like the hot part of the fire.
Well, it just kind of gets a little bit brighter. But that is fun. Oh, that's fun. I'm going to take you on a little ride here. I'll put Lucy on there. Ooh, that, that shine. Sorry. This little wire always sticks to something. How fun is that? Clara! And then look at this over here. How fun is that? Like, you can just continue to just add your colors. Like, I'm going to try to add some of this teal up here. I'm not going to, I don't want to try to put it into the yellow, which I'm sure will go in there, but then it'll turn green. But, Ooh, y'all know what I could do? I could get that smoke I did yesterday. Good, you guys. I think I'm gonna get that. Uh... Thank you, Scarlett. Thanks, Clara. Like, that's so fun. Like just imagine like a long piece, like a 16 by, like a 20 by 60, and just do it straight down the center. Just a negative space all on the sides with just this, like in a, almost like a fire form. God, that would be beautiful. Wow, I'm excited. Babe, come look at this. What is this? Experiment here. I'm just gonna put it on the outside of this white And then I'm gonna take the uh, blending and I'm just gonna Add it to the very end and kind of Blend these two colors together. Let's see how that looks. see that sorry I, I know I was in the way blowing on it but what are you gonna do All right, what, you got? what yeah 
How awesome is that? It looks super great. Put more of that color in there. I just did over here. That's okay. just on a flex right Yeah. I can't see any of the comments. Oh, there. That's a really awesome thing. JJ, these uh, these are Zig. Very nice. Cure Color ink, and then just regular alcohol blending solution. How fun is that, y'all? It's so funny how that. You could just keep going and keep going and keep going with this. Like, does this stuff dry, like, dry, dry? Crazy G Lady, what's up? I'm digging it, y'all. Now I just want it to dry. Do you guys know if this will dry shiny? Or um, maybe tomorrow I'll try to put some uh, some matte spray over it after it's dry. All right, I'm gonna do one more thing. I'm gonna try to spray paint one and set it on fire. You guys know how our fire things go. <laughs> Y'all know you love that. <gasps> Mandy, thank you very much. Thank you very much. All right, let me go spray, let me get some spray paint real quick. All right. And I have my window open, so I'm just gonna lightly spray paint this guy. Do you guys notice how I just kind of spray whenever I'm over the project? You save a lot of paint, a lot of overspray. You will have to seal it, but yes, it will dry. Yeah, I bet like um, some resin over the top of that would look amazing. But I would love it to be uh, like a matte color. So this is my solution. This is just the white and the alcohol blending. Kamar varnish and UV. Okay. 
Let's see here. Ooh, this looks like it's off. Let's try something here. Where's my fire at? I'm gonna move this up so I don't catch my camera on fire. Well, that's fun. Always make sure you have all your fire out. <laughs> I didn't know one time there was a little bit of fire underneath there and I sprayed alcohol and it goes, woof. Well, that's fun. See, it's activating it. That white. You know why it's so lopsided? to make this more and that stuff is really opaque it's on fire It just kind of, that white just takes over everything. But look at this, once you put, put some drops of these colors on here, Oh my gosh, I can't believe how lopsided this is.
Well, that's fun. We know the white burns. Huh. What a good time. Well, it's not as fun as the canvas. That's a little scary. <laughs> so, with that said, it's about that time, folks. I'll give you one last look at the uh, piece I just did. Putting the fire away. No fun. Look how fun that is. Um, I'm really happy with this. Now that we know, like, just mix some white in some blending fluid. And then add your colors with blending fluid and just kind of let it do its thing, man. This is the kind of thing where you just literally have hardly any control. The only control you have is the amount of ink you put on there. The way it's going to end up is completely up to itself. <sighs> and I got to show you one more view. Look at this. How amazing is that? I think what I want to do with this, um, I'll probably pour a, uh, a thin coat over this, let it set, let it cure overnight, sand it, and then draw on it with gold paint pen. I think that would be pretty amazing. But, transparent colors resin. Yeah, well, that's what I was going to do, Claire. I was going to get that. I'll do that tomorrow. I'll get the piece I did with the, the smoke and sand it all down and then put some of that fluid on there and then put the colors. Oh, I bet it would look amazing. Thanks, Miranda. And thank you all for showing up. We appreciate it. Um, that does not go there. Um... Our class is coming up June 1st and 2nd. Uh, it'll be here in Dallas, Texas. Um, just uh, look up on our website, artisttilldeath.com, for the class info. Uh, be sure to sign up. I think we're going to try to have like 15 seats available. Maybe. We'll see. Um, and we're still looking for a spot in Jacksonville, Tampa, Orlando. Somewhere in that vicinity. Uh, for a class from 15 to 20 people uh, sometime around September, October. So it'll be a little bit cooler. Um, I'm sorry if we're not going to any other um, states. We'll, we'll make it there one day. But right now we're just going to concentrate on Florida because it's nice and I have relatives down there. So um, thank you for showing up today. Thank you for always showing up. Thank you for support. Thanks for the donations. <laughs> You guys are awesome. Be kind to one another. You never know what somebody's going through. Um, and remember, your creativity never sleeps. So get out there and just do something creative. Put some ink down. Put some... Just doodle if you want. Doodle's fun. Doodling is a blast. Um, thanks again for showing up, y'all. Um, I'm going to do the new logo. Um, hope you guys have an awesome weekend. We will see you tomorrow. Maybe early. Uh, I don't think we have plans tomorrow. Um, we did join makers. You guys should go join your makers in your area. Um, so with that said, 
Bye.